Hey guys, welcome back to RimWorld. We are the uh, dinosaur hunters. Hunters? Yes, we hunt the dinosaurs. Welcome back. So, uh, the much anticipated naming and shaming has finally been done. So we have Jockey, Talson, Laramie, Elena and Sol in here. Welcome to the colony, boys and girls. And um, where's the there's the Arzang, the new Velociraptor. So our old Velociraptor was completely, totally named after a subscriber before. Completely intentionally. <laughs> uh, why is there a dead boar here? Anyway, and now uh, Ryman Zang wanted to be named as a Velociraptor as well. So here you go, there's our Zang, a new Velociraptor. Good? Good. Okay, and of course we have Steve Phobos over here. We're just chilling. Just chilling. Apparently we have low food, so I would really like if someone went to butcher, but I know I realize that people have other stuff to do. Like Elena desires to actually cook those meals. Would you mind uh, suspending this for a bit, Elena, and then just butchering? Yeah, go for that thing first. That's okay. There's a dead raccoon as well. If you desire to butcher that, that would be completely fine as well. There you go. Some meat has been brought in here. Here you go now. Butchering the raccoon. Okay, good. Good colonies beds. Three here. All right, we got our buddy Soul in last time. So Talsin, would you mind working on this for me? Mm, did we restrict Soul? We didn't. So what if we put Soul on like a night on duty? So it's gonna be fine. Minor break risk. Great. So yeah, there you go. Soul has a poor bed now. Indeed. Completely nice and awesome and fine. Elena keeps on butchering the animals that are not in the fridge. You know what? I, I kind of like that. Oh, there's a person that has been actually stripped. What the hell is going on? It's uh, indeed very nice. These things I would really like to be pulled urgently out of here. I do not desire to have them here. Oh, someone put this trouser off. That's good. That's good, good, good. Got him getting some meals. <laughs> we got him some meals? And when I say we got him some meals, I meant we're getting in some uh, raw food in the case of meat. Thousand, is this really a priority? I guess it is. I would really like you to actually work on this as well. If you could. We go hauling steel. Oh, Sol is happily mining here, getting us some titanium. That's much needed. Thankfully. There's another shirt that could be hauled away. Sure, hold that away. There we go. Those guys have been mostly stripped. I think we need some uh, graves over Dusty. So let's get some graves underneath the trees. <laughs> I guess we can uh, have another grave over here. And this tree can have a grave. And this tree can have a grave. Yeah, it's, it's completely weird. And not something I wanted to do, but hey, I kind of like it right now. So let's keep on doing it. So Alison, what you doing? Holding steel? Okay. Why are you so almost broken? Awful barracks. Served corpses. Joy deprived. You lovers. Lord Nemo and Elena. Okay, Nemo. See? Now you're banging a camel. Elena, no offense. You know, you know what I mean. You know what I mean. No offense, men there. It's fine. Uh, but you are a camel in here. Relaxing socially, you can start cooking some meats now. Cook the meat, make it into fine, awesome meals. Uh, or just use the rice, that's okay as well. I'm, I'm not mad. Good, uh, looks like Lord Nemo has finally planted uh, the hill roots, which means he can also go back to cooking now. Are you two guys on the same schedule? Nemo is day guy and Elena is night time lady. I'll have to fix that schedule soon enough if you want to sleep together. Uh, well, you know, this is nice. He's butchering. She's cooking. It would probably be better to be otherwise. Uh, that thing should be reversed, but that's okay. Uh, okay, so let's get you back to... You could go back to number two on cooking and go back and research. Let me do this. Right? I think that's gonna be fine. Elena's gonna rest now. It's okay. What's Nemo gonna do? He's gonna take a piss. Not even wash his hands. Okay, buddy, okay. It's, it's fine, I guess. It's fine, I guess. 
There's still butchering to be done, but now at least we have 500 meat. So I'm, I'm happy. I'm happy in that sense. There's stuff that needs to be built. Thousand. Gonna go back to bed. What are you doing on this? Uh, all you need is components now, so uh, that's actually great. Hold this away. Get the heal root going. We spent all of our heal root, didn't we? Mm, pretty much. So, uh, something that we do quite require now is better defense structure. I know that <laughs> what I've done this time around with this separate buildings that are all kind of connected or not connected, you know, depends on how you look at it, it's uh, very hard to be defensible. And usually I did try to get things very defensible and try to make things work nicely. But right now it's kind of kind of all messed up and you know it's such by design truth be told no, that's okay but I think now it's time we go and say hey they recruit good stuff we go and uh, build a wall like this let's build a wall we recruit Laramie successfully recruit them all hey mall you're gonna weird up stuff as a sidearm, you can equip a sidearm, really? On your own? You're good at that, aren't you? Well, you have a sidearm. Now. And this is poor LMG, incendiary launcher. How's this gun, actually? Monty Python gun. Drop this. Equip this as a normal arm and not a sidearm. And get an iron wood ship as a. Sidearm, maybe? More iron wound ships? Maybe equip like... Uh, not incendiary grenades, that would be bad. Steel ship, there you go, as a sidearm, that's much better. How's this thing? 6%, it's beautiful. So, welcome to the colony, Mal. Uh, you're a constructor, right? Yeah, there you go. Oh, he's also a crafter. We got ourselves a crafter, number one crafter, when this needs to be done. Uh, so, sure, for now do that. Also good research. Mal, you are quite an awesome person, I must admit. Uh, you will have other work to do before you do this stuff, yeah? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, Mal needs a name. Mal, are you a lady or are you a girl? You are <laughs> a lady or a girl? A lady or a male, so... Mal Malifalo, Malifalo, your name shall now be Evgeny. Welcome to the club, Evgeny. And uh, you do kind of need a bed. Where would you like to sleep? My friend. My friend. Uh, make this out of wood. My Evgeny. My Evgeny. Don't lie to me. Tell me where do you want to sleep tonight? My computer. My computer is crazy and so has been in an ugly environment. Poor guy. Or a girl, poor girl. I do like uh, your uh, your jacket. What's this jacket? Gazelle leather duster. I like it. It's pretty good. Okay, you guys have been stripped. Now that means uh, this clothing needs to be pulled away urgently, for I do not want it in my fridge. This is the most awful fridge I ever had. Truth be told, I'm pretty sure my people don't quite like seeing the corpses here. Although, these corpses are here because I want dinosaurs to eat them. And the wild boars can eat them as well. Now, but what you usually should do is... Um, oh, the thousand. It's good. <laughs> this magic bandana is pretty good. Uh, what you should usually do is have a separate, a separate uh, storage area for corpses where uh, your colonists usually won't go. And uh, use that for your animals to feed in. Uh, but of course, we haven't done that this time around. Oh good, we have the proper research bench now. Elena's happily researched, you can believe turrets. Indeed. Turrets, indeed. Now Thousand is gonna work here. We're gonna maybe leave a small area over here. Patch it up this. There's some uh, steel we can get eventually. We're gonna patch it up that way. And here, and go up here and here. And then across. And it's gonna be a huge place that we're gonna wall in, but 
Uh, how we are actually gonna do a proper defense, I have no idea yet. You know, in the last two series, we used the river as a defensive uh, position. This time around, let's not do it. Although, I reckon it's gonna be kinda tough to survive anyway. Because we are, of course, playing on the Hildegard Epic and on extreme difficulty. Which means there's gonna be a lot of raids happening. And we are definitely not prepared to deal with the raids as it was shown last time when this guys attacked me and all of my people almost died. So, uh, no. Uh, Elena, you are now gonna be on the same duty as Lord Nemo so you can sleep together. Which means we're gonna push Evgeny to nighttime job. Yeah, that's okay. That's my animals. Our Zang still doesn't want to cooperate, so what can a man do? Hmm. No food? Still no food? Hopefully my people will start cooking some stuff. They're all uh, hauling, which means just Lord Nemo. Oh, this is like Lord Nemo, you don't need to hold plus, okay? You can now uh, butcher and cook and stuff. I think my Velociraptors are killing something again. Arzang, you got yourself injured. Again, by Tertus. So Velociraptors are quite, quite mad, but they kill stuff, then they rest. Laramie, what is this hat on your head? Kemp? Hemp Cappy. Okay. You are a dangerous man, my friend. Dangerous man indeed. Uh, I think we still need more uh, food. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tell um, our, our Huntero to go hunt some uh, mufflos. We are our Huntero, go hunt some mufflos. Yeah, you do that, buddy. That's all you should be doing. I mean, there's not much else you do, so uh, that's fine. Soul is no longer wandering in sadness. So that's good to hear. Kenny and Towson are both at sleep. Are you both nighttime people? Yeah, you are. So uh, during daytime, we don't build anything, and that is something I don't necessarily want. So, you know what? Again, it's fine. You're gonna go back to nighttime to daytime duty, and we're gonna actually put uh, DR Huntera on nighttime since you're okay with that. I hope. I hope. Laramie the Dreamer. What is this? What are you? Childhood dreamer. Larry was an expressive child. He sang often and made friends very easily, but be they young or old, male or female. He hated fighting, but when made angry, he could be dangerous. His temper was quick. So Laramie, you're the dreamer. You're 19 years old. And, uh... You know what? I don't blame you for your dreams. Everyone likes dreams. Oh, there's some uh, empty graves now. Which, uh, would you mind? Here, there. Can you actually... You cannot. Okay, that's okay. Yo, King, I'm gonna get rid of this for you, okay, buddy? Thousand. Thousand's gonna do it. Thousand. Very cheddar. Thanks, buddy. There's some corpse bile on the ground. That's pretty good. Get this guy buried as well. We might need in the grave. No. Work on this for me, please. And I'm gonna give you another grave over here. Maybe I should really stop putting them under trees. You're gonna eat next to a grave. You know what? That's okay. Who am I to judge you? Who am I to judge you indeed? Work on this also. Okay, this is... Uh, not my Velociraptor, and uh, it's kind of bad. I think we need to squat up and take care of this Velociraptors that are close by. Brachiosaurus just died. <laughs> Not that he actually died, but he's weird like that. I think we're gonna go for that Velociraptor, although I'm kind of scared what could happen if uh, we don't murder him right away. So, bury this guy. I'm thinking maybe someone's gonna die if we don't take proper care of them. Everyone squat up. Go here, let's say. Leo's here. So Leo's gonna help. You should. Yes, good. Got him down. I repeat, we got him down. Everyone's fine. 
you will have major break risks. That's okay, but uh, haul him in. I want to eat him. Okay. I want you to butcher him. I want you to eat him. God damn it, computer, stop it. <laughs> He's making the weird noises when I play RimWorld. And usually when I play Warcraft as well. So, uh, you know, that would make you think that it's being... Oh, alligator is not stripped. Okay. It's being under pressure. Under pressure. Dun -dun 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 -dun. Phobos, will you be able to haul soon? Yeah. Yeah. You'll be able to haul soon. That's nice to know. Uh, also, I need floors over here. Not the outsoil, just just floors. I know this is not priority. Like we build this weird wall down here, and that's really great defense. Sure. <laughs> I mean, <coughs> everyone that has five seconds time can come in and just murder us. It's uh, it's not a great way. Not a great defensive position at all. But, 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 eventually in like 15 episodes, if you're still alive, we're gonna have good defensive positions. You'll see. You'll see and you will marvel. You will marvel at the marble. Now, I have a problem that we have no steel whatsoever, right? Did you get me any steel? 63 so, huh? Well, you got us some jade as well, so I can't blame you. There you go, there's the wall, so far. Uh, I need to check what else do we have over here. We have 210 limestone still, so, uh, might as well, might as well do this. And I don't need to do this there. This is fun. This is fun and dandy. We're gonna also do this. And we're gonna also do that. And then we're gonna do this. Okay, this looks weird. Do it like this. Yeah. And then like this. Okay, let's stop doing because I might run out of limestone in the time in the meantime, but now let's do it like this. Um where's the other Velociraptors? I don't know. Here's another Velociraptor, yep. Yeah. Okay, he's murdering stuff up here, so that's fine. You go ahead and do that. Murder all the boars that you want. Murder all the boars that you desire. Just leave us alone. Some gold ore. Some gold in that here mountain. We have a lost raptor in here. Maybe we butchered him already. Or I do not see him there. Timberwolf skin. Pig skin. Coon. Turkey deer hide. And. Deer to be butchered. Oh, there it is. Okay. Elena is picking on food. Okay. It's Good thing it says low food over here, you know, Elena. That's great. But at least we got potatoes and rice now, so uh, no one can say that's not the case. Let's hold this in, please. Don't want it to go bad. You guys have time to do that. And yes, we need to put corpses somewhere else. And when I say corpses, I mean the human corpses. And it's October, so I'm guessing it's not gonna be so cold anymore. We did use limestone here, did we? Um, let's just do this. Now it's gonna be a small corpse area. Small corpse area is all we need. And I'm fine with just wooden doors. I'm fine with that. And then a cooler. <clears throat> and then a stockpile for corpses. The human corpses, that is. Human corpses. You get it? Hopefully you will work on this for me. That would be nice. I trapped this Brachiosaurus in the mountain as well. Did you see that? His head was in the mountain. He was looking over the mountain. Good guy. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool indeed. Now, I know we're gonna have the space of the mountain here, but we're not gonna be building it here. At least that's not the plan. Because uh, I just want to have one series with all the freaking bugs spawning. You know, that would be great. Unless there's a hive spawning in this, but I don't think it can. You know, uh, I'm not sure, of course. But... Phobos is hauling. That's extremely important, and I really like it. Phobos is actually hauling. Talos is gonna build this area for me. Talos and his uh, manic bandana. 
poor one, but it looks cool. It looks cool like that. Of course, my stockpile is now completely too small. I wanted this. I wanted to have this for weapons mainly, but hey, it's fine. Ironwood cloak, huh? Uh, I've seen there's a bunch of ironwood trees here that we can harvest later on. Actually, have some ironwood stuff. That wouldn't be too bad. Thousand. Building stuff for me, yeah, yeah, that's my boy. That's my boy Towson. My boy Towson, and then we're gonna have all the corpses be hauled away. And maybe one day we're gonna actually have some meals cooked. But uh, for that, we'll probably need a proper cook, not a Nemo with number six in cooking, and Elena with number four. <laughs> yeah, we need something better than that. We need something a lot better than that. But oh well, it's gonna be done eventually. This we have components right now. Lemon turk leather, some galley mimus hide. We can make out something out of that. I guess. <coughs> there you go. Thousand making the cooler. I would prefer if you made the door first, but you know, who am I to judge you? Now, do you not have the power? You do not have the power. Of course you don't. Why would you? Get the power going, Dusty. Yeah, build a roof. Build a roof. Go build the power after that. Okay, Holding steel to power conduit. Good, good, good. In the meantime, I'm gonna make this a uh, storage area. Here, all critical. And it's gonna be corpses, human like corpses. Indeed. And we're gonna say, hey, bunch of these corpses. Let's hold them urgently away. And they shall forever lie in here. I wonder, can uh, can my boar haul urgently? I don't know. Or can he just haul? I wish he could haul urgently, that would be great. Thousand Holding steel to power conduits again, holding steel to power conduits. Good. I'm guessing you went far away to get that, there you go. Go. This is being done. Thousand. Awesome. Now, you gonna work on this for me? I know we need a bridge over here as well. It's not of utmost importance though. This guy should be stripped. Okay, Thousand is gonna bring enough. He's gonna eat a meal and then I really need you to do a lot more revenge. Arzan got us. We got this and I went the wrong direction. Thousand. Awesome. Wanna go eat? I'm gonna go, uh. No, 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 don't, don't rest. I need this power conduit to be built today. I'm sorry. Sorry? I'm sorry. I'm terribly sorry. But this is gonna be done today. Indeed. Let's go, boy. Let's go. Thousand, you are my main constructor right now. Besides Genny. So you two guys will be under pressure a lot. As in every series, apparently, I pressure my builders the most. And, you know, that's understandable, because they are here to ensure the success of this colony. Let's get this cold. Good, good, good. Gun turrets finally have been done. Nice. Nicely done, son. As for the floors, sure, let's go with this here. Again, something is being murdered. That's all right. Genny is building over here. Good, good, good. Genny is quite mad at the world, though. Ten at construction already. It's pretty good. Yeah, he's like extremely, extremely mad. <laughs> the barracks is awful. I really should start building separate rooms for my people. But what is most important? Are outdoors defense or my mental thresholds of my people? Well. Is very much debatable, to be honest. What is more important? Please click on this. 35, 47. Not nearly enough to actually cover all all the base basics, all the base basics. But soon. All right, we need a research project. Sure. Uh, I want the machining and stuff like that. So let's go towards that. <coughs> let's go towards that. Elena can research some stuff for me. Are you gonna finally get Leo to do something for me? Oh my god, Leo can now almost... Oh. 
40% chance in training, that's nice, that's much better. And of course Arzang still can't even be obedient. Get Arzang to be obedient. Did you like, uh, where are you at? Antero. Did you get your skills up? 16% now, or at 16 now. You used to be lower. I don't know. Maybe training that uh, board got you up there. Quite possibly. Quite possibly indeed. Oh, excuse me? Dropping power? Well done. Well done, I guess it's time for another uh, turbine. Let's go. Let's go then. Of utmost importance. Gany? Or Talson? Talson? Where can this prioritize it? There's some steel here, sure. Or on that, you're gonna have to run around and get a ton more steel somewhere. Over the rainbow. Uh, I could get my miner soul to actually go over here and mine this out, actually. So, yeah, dig this compacted steel for me. That's gonna be better. I believe that's gonna be better. Need to get some lights in the darkness as well. We're we doing king. Good at melee. Oh, you're a brawler. We do need a brawler. So, uh, sure. Chat to recruit. Hmm. You have friends. 65% is not too hard to recruit, actually. I know there's some kidneys and hearts on the floor, but let that not disturb you, my friend. Let that not disturb you. Now, my question is how much wood do we have? Doesn't appear that there's any uh, wood out here so basically we have all this 200 334 so there's some in here as well okay okay there is idle lord nemo has a major break risk uh we could get uh, higher meat supplies sure it shouldn't be a problem get some oh i guess uh, the wild boar that we're trying to tame died got eaten by something h10 now you're too old i'm sorry you h4 try taming that one okay other than that go hunt the male wild boars please yeah, go for that here comes dr huntero trying to tame another boar there's a fox foxy he failed new recruit oh we got a king we got king nice with long coat. Mm, we knew we now need a good uh, melee weapon for you, which we don't actually have. Yeah, put a gas mask on. That's the spirit. He's awesome. Take a simple meal. Why is there a turkey ladder in here? It's disappointing. Are you really want to equip uh, LMG as a sidearm? I don't think that's a good idea. It's, did you? Uh, I have a lot of iron wood chips, huh? The pillar? Let's get the pillar out of here. I really need you to do some good melee stuff. So let's check. What do you have? Steel shiv. You don't have anything. You have a steel karambit 30%. It's a bamboo club. It's awful. Steel shiv. Nothing. Steel shiv. Nothing, of course. And Sol has a steel ship. I think this Karambit's pretty good. Hear that. Oh, okay. okay, I wanna, I wanna see the aim for this. Okay, it's pretty fucking horrible. How much damage does a steel or a iron wood ship does? It's much slower. Still six damage. Um, yeah, jockey. Drop that for me. Thank you. King. Equip the steel karambit. It's not gonna do much, but it's gonna be better than nothing, okay? So what are you good at? What are you good at? Uh not much. <coughs> Apparently you're gonna construct. So uh that's okay. Construction is always good. Always appreciated. You can't haul. So I guess you will do construction number one. There's a mad animal. And uh you do have some passion of this, so we can get this going like dustly. That's fine. Mad animal, local raccoon. 
No, don't, don't tame it. Hold it. Oh, Ganny is gonna take care of it. Let's go, Ganny, let's go. Murder it. King! Oh, no, coon. Melody the coon! There you go, show your karambit skills. There you go, good guys. You have done it. You got scratched by coons a bit, but that's okay. That's okay. The colonist beds, yeah, that would be a good idea. What if I told you this could be a colonist bed? I know it's awful, but it could be. Say, so welcome to the club, King. We need to name you. Oh, no, I don't really have names right now. I do have a female name, but uh, uh, I don't think... You know what? It doesn't really matter, does it? Well, I guess it does to the lady that wanted to be named, because she stated that she would like to be a female. So, uh, let's not name King then. Not quite yet. Anyway, um, I'm gonna finish the episode here for now. Thank you all for watching. Do hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please consider dropping a comment down below. Share, like, subscribe, and I see more doing magic. And I'll see you next time. Kirk out.